Hi, I'm Pastor Dustin Lenz here at Living Waters Lutheran Church in Crystal Lake. I want to share with you how um, when I was a child in probably the second grade, I had determined that I was going to read through the Bible from beginning to end. And so I opened up our dusty family heirloom of a Bible that sat underneath one of our coffee tables, opened it up and started reading from the very first page. Little did I know in the second grade that books like the Bible have an introduction with a lot of scholarly language that explains how they've come up with their translation. And so after a couple of days and only a few paragraphs in, I gave up on trying to read through scripture. Since then, I've had to, by sheer will, try to uh, engage scripture to read through uh, the Bible and to uh, try to grasp it and to get to know and, and read through it. Sometimes it uh, didn't connect, and so I had s struggled through those uh, different passages and different areas of Scripture. Sometimes, just because of the literary style, I wasn't able to figure it out in how, what was being spoken into that. And so for those of you who have had those issues from time to time, trying to read through the Bible and trying to place different pieces of it, I want to invite you into a, an adventure, an exploration that we are doing here at Living Waters this year. We're going to be using a resource called The Story this year. And what The Story is, is it's for those of you who have lost or tried to figure out the Bible and just can't it because it's so vast. That trying to put all the individual pieces and place them is becoming a, a, a struggle. Or you've not picked up the Bible in so long that you can't remember where each of these different stories fits in to the whole picture of what God has been doing from the beginning to the end. And so what the story is, is it's 31 chapters of scripture or of the Bible from beginning to end, and it reads more like a novel from uh, throughout. And so you're able to read it more in a style that's comfortable to us today. And by doing this, by exploring this throughout this year, uh, we hope and pray that you will come to become more of a devoted follower, a devoted reader of the, of the Bible. As you pick up the regular one, you'll start to understand and make connections of how this passage that you didn't maybe read in the story is read here and you're able to put it where it belongs and to understand what was going on around that period of time or what was going on uh, as that passage was written and be able to place it and therefore better understand it and come to know how God has been at work then and is at work today in our own lives. I pray that you will come and participate. First off, the, one of the easiest ways to participate in this exploration is through uh, coming on Sunday mornings. Our sermons will be geared towards uh, e uh, an individual chapter each week. Second off, by picking up a copy of the story and reading that chapter along with us each week so you're a little bit more aware of what the heck's going on. Or, and also maybe checking out some of the, the background information and questions that we have uh, in, on our website. And if you're feeling like you want to connect with other people around the different chapters, joining one of the many small groups. I hope and pray that you will engage in this study this year, in this exploration of Scripture this year. I hope that through it you will grow closer to God, come to know Christ's love for yourself, and be better equipped to see God at work in your life and in our world.